मुहूर्ते संसदे बक्तव्य रखें तृणमूल सांसद सुदीप बंदोपाध्याय At the time of war in Bangladesh, we still remember it. There are exemplary precedents like this in the history of Indian Parliament. Opposition facing treasury benches, treasury benches opposition. These were reflected in the House on many occasions, on several times, but which is now being totally invisible. Keeping faith upon international solidarity and brotherhood. Our Parliament has expressed solidarity with many other countries who have fought for their independence. Sir, I was first elected in 12th Lok Sabha as Trinamool Congress candidate. That time, our party leader Mamta Banerjee. It was the first time a new political party entered into the Parliament, and that time, she raised her voice in Parliament. For one third reservation of in Lok Sabha and Assembly, the incident we still remember. She caught one MP by neck when she was going to tear the bill which was placed, which was going to be placed on the floor of the house. Now Sonia ji has also written a letter to Honourable Prime Minister to take it up. Sir, our demand would be that in the next. current new lok sabha building parliament building let this women reservation bill be tabled and let it be passed without further delay let it be initiated with a positive direction by which this parliament can start can initiate its journey with a very positive outlook sir all of government by one vote we have witnessed it sitting on the floor of the house and we have seen the power of the parliament how peacefully the voting pattern went on and just next to me chandrashekhar ji was sitting he asked me sudeep what is the result of the vote i said bajpayee ji has been defeated by margin of one vote only he said it to me Oh ho! If I had the idea, I could have voted for Bajpayee ji, by which the vote pattern could have been different. So these are the memories which haunt me always. Sir, let the present house run with a positive direction. Common principle of parliamentary democracy is that house belongs to the opposition. I tell it. at the all party meeting so in our honorable speaker convens that in a parliamentary democratic system house should belongs to the opposition but now a days bills are being passed without debate or discussions it is not a good precedent both sides are to be more objective in their approach in their outlook and when a house can run properly if the ruling party takes a positive decision then only it becomes possible otherwise it is not possible for the opposition to run the house in a proper manner the gst declaration being celebrated by convening midnight parliament session it was held to make it historical but many important and extraordinary situations prevailing in the country are not being allowed to raise and discuss in the house sir brute majority in parliament by one political party at this present parliament reflects its arrogance is not desirable what my long experiences say that if brute majority persists they are in a mood to gag the voice of the opposition it is neither desirable nor it is supported by all the members so we will approach to the ruling party to make themselves restrained in the coming sessions long since it is proven parliament session must reflect with more positivity and become as result oriented 